hi friends welcome back so in this video you will be learning about if you wanted to become a manual tester what are the various skill sets are required that i am going to discuss in this video if you want to become a software tester in the manual side definitely this video will be very useful for you the first skills you should know whenever you wanted to become manual tester is you should have a good understanding in the software development life cycle sdlc and also various testing methodologies it could be agile methodologies or waterfall methodologies at least you should know because these days everywhere everybody most of the people uses agile testing methodology and uh, if it is very big project and long tenured project then they will go for waterfall model and the second aspect is you should have a clear understanding on all the various uh, testing techniques and methodologies we adopt while we are creating a test cases while we are executing a test cases the testing technique can be your white box testing block box testing gray box testing unit testing and so on and the next aspect is as we discussed earlier various test design techniques can be especially this is for creating the test cases one is uh, boundary value analysis equivalence partitioning and uh, other uh, different uh, techniques also will be available as part of test design uh, aspects next thing is you should have a strong problem solving skills plus debugging skills as well because in order to find a defect we may require to understand all the details effectively and also in order to reproduce a defect as well you should have a good debugging skills as well next type of uh, aspect you should know here is you should know all different types of software testing it could be your functional testing non-functional testing acceptance testing regression testing etc there are various uh, types of testing at least you should have a clear uh, knowledge on all these various uh, uh, different types of tests whenever you are taking up uh, manual software tester job and the next type of uh, skills you would be required is at least you should have a good understanding on the handling of uh, bug tracking tools because after we write the test cases we execute those test cases whenever we find the issues where we will have to log those issues or problems golden days used to enter in an excel sheet nowadays when we are no more use any excel sheet to track bugs where we will be using jira or bugzilla or any software tool to manage the bugs in the system because of that you should know in and out of uh, bug tracking tools what are the various uh, flows of a given bug or what are the various states of a bug you should know thoroughly and the next aspect is we should have a good uh, written and oral communication skills because written skills are very much required in order to write a test cases plus uh, in order to send uh, email status reports talking to the various stakeholders we will be required oral communication skill as well uh, you should be uh, having a ability to write and review test cases test plan if your application is a cross browser cross platform means uh, various different browsers we wanted to test or different operating systems we want to test whether it is a desktop or mobile operating systems whatever across various different platforms then uh, you should have exposure in those aspects as well and uh, attention to the detail this is very key if you wanted to become or you wanted to become a successful in software testing you should be having attention to very much details and also ability to identify edge cases or boundary cases or negative cases in order to find as many defects as possible these are the these are the some of the very basic key skills if you have definitely you can become a good uh, manual software tester 